Hi there, welcome to Dundee Piano. Today we're going to be having a look at a few scales. Now I've been asked to look at some scales and just give people a heads up on what scales are required for what grades. Um, and this one we'll have a look at grade 3 scales. Okay. Now I have videos for each individual scale but for the purposes of this video we'll just look at all the grade 3 scales together in a very quick version. Okay. So first of all we've got A major. And for this grade, two octaves, yeah? So... Nice and even, steady, straight up and down, yeah? So there's your A major. And you add a sharp and you go to E major. on that one. Add another sharp, you've got B major. Remember, four on the left. Oh. So there's all your sharp majors, the three of them, A, E, B. Then you switch over to the flats, okay? So you have two flats at this grade, B flat major, E flat major. Okay, so B flat, here. There we go. I must admit I'm impressed I can do that. It's one of the trickier ones for me. That's two flats. Okay, and then the third flat comes when you go to E flat major. the finger and slightly you can probably improve on that on the finger on that side but anyway that's your majors then your minors we have B minor so very similar shape and position to B major the only difference being the third and the sixth are natural yeah there's one of them there's the other one so D and D and G are natural, okay? So B minor. Okay, I need to practice that one a bit more, obviously. Um, B minor, G minor, here we go. So the middles are flat. And then, very similar, C minor. So flat. So there we go. There's all your similar motion scales. So practice all one, two, three, four, five majors and three minors. So that's eight scales. Practice all of them, both hands up and down, two octaves. Boom. Now you have your contrary motion scales. You have A major, contrary motion. Let's have a go. It's been a while, but I'll try. but that's the idea A major outwards then you go to A harmonic minor so the G sharp is still there but nothing else there we go so just the sharp on the G not the other ones okay so that's two two contrary motions major and minor then we have chromatic scales now at this grade they are separate, so that's fine. A flat, two octaves. There's your A flat. Okay, and just separately, and also C made C as well. C chromatic, which I wouldn't do because you can easily do that. It just starts on C. Now, finally, for this video, the arpeggios for grade three. They basically just use the same set of scales or keys, I should say, that the scales are in. So you have your five majors and your three minors. The difference being that A major, G minor are hands together, but all the rest are separately. So they've put them together, the two ones that are very similar patterned. Okay, I'll have another video which has all the arpeggios, but this one we'll just look at this group. So A major, 
you want to be in open kind of position and in G minor there we go so they're both very similar they're like a tone away and the middles are flat now the other ones are all hands apart so you have E major which is actually very similar to A and then B major with two sharps B flat major, one flat, E flat major, and then minor, B minor, and then C minor, and the same on the other hand, yeah. Etc. So you can practice all of them, each hand for those six and then the other two hands together. Okay so that rounds up our video of scales and arpeggios for grade three. Hopefully that's been helpful and uh, take care. Bye for now.